full details in the blog post linked in the description. The blog post will be kept up to date with any new details that appear. Try a software update. There is a possibility that there is a software bug causing the issue. You can turn on automatic software updates by going Settings, then Support, then Software Update, and ensure Auto Update is turned on. Alternatively, you can manually update over the internet by clicking Update Now. Try doing a soft reset. Often, a soft reset is all that is needed to solve issues on a Samsung TV. A soft reset does not erase any data. To soft reset a Samsung TV, you simply need to turn the TV off, then remove the plug from the wall outlet and wait for 60 seconds, then put the plug back in and turn the TV on again. Try a hard reset. A hard reset involves completely resetting the TV to its factory defaults and your data will be erased. To do this, do the following. Turn on the TV and press the home button on the remote. Go to settings, then click general, then click reset. You must then enter a four digit pin number, which is 0000 by default. Then click yes to reset the TV. The TV will then turn off once it has finished resetting. You can now turn the TV back on and set it up again. Do a picture test. A picture test is a self-diagnostic process that allows the TV to identify the problem and find a suitable solution. To do this, do the following. Press the settings button, go to support, go to device care, go to self-diagnosis, then click picture test. Ensure that the cables are connected correctly. It could be the case that the blue lines are being caused by a problem with the cables connected to the TV, especially the HDMI cables. It would help to make sure that they are connected properly. If you happen to have another HDMI, try using that as instead and see if it solves the issue. If there is still an issue with your TV, try taking a look at the comments. I will also keep the blog post linked in the description, updated with any new details that emerge.